I don't know. I guess even coming from a loving family, I'm still messed up and insecure. But you know, so are you, or you would have believed me when I said that what happened with Brian was a huge mistake and that it meant nothing. Yeah, maybe you're right, we are both messed up. So, instead of pointing out each other's faults, maybe, maybe we could try to help each other? Maybe the answer is we try and fix us as a couple. Maybe the answer is to focus on fixing ourselves so we can stop hurting the people we care about. So we just go our separate ways for the good of... I don't even know what it's for the good of. No, I don't know how to do that. Well, I think the first step is to get off this roof. You're saying if you had the chance to get lucky one night with some random hot girl, you would turn her down because she wouldn't fit into your picket fence fantasy? Okay, maybe I'm not completely reformed, but overall I'm looking for more than a one-night stand. And if you found the right girl, you would walk away from your single life without ever looking back? In a red-hot minute, then. Hear that? They don't hear anything. Exactly. <laughs> I think they're making up. See, you know, love wins out every time. Open the door and let us off this roof! Now! <laughs> 